How would you like me to fuck up some people for you? How would you like revenge? You want me to sell you my soul? Astute, very astute. I said no. Yes, but you see, the thing is, no one says no. I did. But that's just because you don't understand the value of the offer. I don't mean to boast, but I've only been doing this a few hundred years and I recently just got promoted. And you know what? The key to my success is authenticity. My offer is authentic. It's detailed and it's authentic. And people are statistically authentically happy when they work with me. How experienced are you? Would you like to hear some of my favorite punishments? Can I stop you? Okay, great, here we go. Pox on the cows. Pox on the hens. Pox on the baby. What about wholesale slaughter? Oh, well, that is a thing that we, it's just sort of an advanced offering. But we do do that, it just tends to be advanced. Advanced like how? Advanced like that's the kind of deals you make with men? And do women get pox? Okay. It just sort of works out like that. It's not, and women have their own, and they tend to be the ones who ask me, so I'm not, but. So, it just generally works out like that. It's unconsciously. Well, maybe if you consciously offered women wholesale slaughter more often, it would work out in a different way, generally. Maybe it might. Well, are you done with your pitch? Well, I guess not because you didn't like it. I didn't say I didn't like it. I just said it was trivial and I asked for a less trivial version. Would you like to hear my less trivial version? Would you like to deliver your less trivial version? I wouldn't mind the opportunity. Okay, you're on. Okay. 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 Picture this. A sea of blood. A tsunami rises up it too, made of blood. A tsunami of blood crashes down on your village. The people who have scorned you, taken your place in line at the well, imagine their faces as the blood wave devours them. They're crying out for help and then they are gone. You were a victim. You were helpless in the face of their cruelty. Now you are revenged. Yes? No? Mm. Visual. Poetic. Pitch it to me the way you would pitch it to a man. That, that was. Visual. Poetic. No. You'd appeal to a different sense of self, wouldn't you? I'm standing here. I am Sir Arthur. I run this town. I have the biggest balls you've ever seen. Pitch it to me now. Okay, Sir Arthur. It's nice to meet you. I've heard a lot about you. Get to the point. The point, Sir Arthur, is that I have something that you've always wanted. The power to destroy. Now you may see yourself as a man who builds, but trust me, there's nothing so fully entwined with creation than the act of destruction. And power, sir, is what I bring to the table. That was different. Forgive me. Even the greatest salesman sometimes miscalculates his audience. Is that what happened, do you think? Did you miscalculate me? I think everybody does, and they do it all the time. But I won't make that mistake again.